The safety in the numbers of this godforsaken town It's been a week since all of this went down In this abandoned factory There's no one here but you and me God help any fool who comes around And you With your cold fickle eyes Who get you away And me I have got no say in my own destiny The way it's going sticky be Are you will be the death of me That's fine. It's only something 49. I'll sleep it off tomorrow if I can. I take the pills, I think I'll take more I thought that I left them right here in the drawer I guess I'll sit and think about The last time that I took them out Maybe I will remember where they are
We're crashed out in a field in misery. Me and you in my 82 BW in hiding. Hello there, it's Paul here and welcome along everyone. Uh, project this time, table lamps. Uh, first time I've ever tried this. Uh, I had actually bought the fittings probably a few weeks ago and planned to do this and finally got around to it. But, well, if you're making a table lamp, you can't really just make one, can you? So at the same time, I made a pair. Uh, they're both oak. The stems is some free wood, but off cuts that I picked up from when I went down to Hollywood. Uh, that's just that south of Birmingham. The base uh, was an oak bowl blank. Now, when I turned the stems, absolutely brilliant. Loads of scooches of work. Uh, the whole first stem came out absolutely perfect. Second stem did duplicated as much as I possibly could, um, got to the very final point at the top here and all of a sudden I just started getting catcher's galore. So I had to go back, to, once I'd finished off what I, the, the shape I'd done, I had to go back to the first one and alter that one so that one matched as well. The real big problems really came though when I started doing the bases today. Um, the oak bowl blank, it wasn't until I actually rounded it off and trued it all up and everything, faced it off, all of a sudden I started seeing these big cracks through it. Uh, I carried on, made sure I was well out of the firing line if anything flies off. Uh, they've been glued, all sorts, um, and to be honest they wouldn't take a lot to snap. But this is my first attempt at lamps and I'm really pleased with them but the base has just spoiled them a bit really. Uh, my only other thing as well is, I mean, I absolutely love the stems, really do. Uh, the base could probably really do, ideally do, we're probably not being quite so wide, maybe take 20, 30 mil off the diameter, uh, and ideally thicker as well. So just whatever you lose on the side, just probably increase the height. Uh, but again, every lamp is different, I suppose. Uh, everybody has their own tastes. I've only literally just glued these up probably about an hour or so ago into the base. Uh, the brass bit that goes in the top, um, that's I've just epoxied that in uh, rather than trying to thread it in because I couldn't find any nuts that would fit the thread. Uh, so that's just there, waiting to dry off. Uh, I bought some cable as well, so I've just got to probably tomorrow or whenever I come out next just wire them up and they will be finished. For a change, this time I'll give them sand and cedar. They've been sanded to 400 and they've had wood wax 22 and the chestnut microcrystalline micro wax. And finish wise, I think the calf absolutely brilliant. Really thoroughly enjoyed doing these and like I say, it's something I've wanted to do for quite a while and it's something I will make again. Uh, I think next time though, I have a big lump of ash that I bought when I was down at Hollywood again. And I think even if I use the whole lot, I will make another couple more lamps, but make them a lot better. Uh, they probably won't be shown on a project video, but they will go up probably on my own Instagram and Facebook and stuff like that. So obviously look below for links for Instagram, etc. So if this is your first time here, uh, please do subscribe. I put up regular videos usually every week, and at least that way you'll get notified every time I upload another new video. For my existing subscribers, again, as per usual, a big, big thank you very much for keep coming back. Um, your support is so most appreciated. I would appreciate it if everybody hit the share button, hit the like button, and please leave some comments below. Uh, love doing the ski work. Like I say, bases are just sport a bit really, but they're probably just going, going to go in our bedroom. So thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you on the next project video. Bye.
my bed and thought I was dead I swear that I didn't come sit in this chair 